Hello everyone. Welcome to CATIA tutorial. I am B. Rakesh, Assistant Professor in Department of Mechanical Engineering, Kids W. In this video lecture, I am going to explain how to construct the given uh, 2D sketch in the CATIA V5 workbench. Now, the given sketch is Cork Gasket. Uh, before going to construct this 2D sketch, first you can open the CATIA V5 software. In this, you can choose Mechanical Design Sketcher Workbench. Uh, in this specification tree, you can choose uh, one plane. Now I am choosing XY plane. Okay, before going to construct uh, any 2D sketch in CATIA V5, first you can set the units. Click Tools menu, Options. In this uh, left side, you can choose General uh, Parameters and Measure. In right side tab, you can choose uh, Units. Uh, in the first one, Length. You can uh, change the units by using this uh, uh, this icon. Uh, it shows different types of units. In this, I am choosing inches. The given figure having all dimensions are inches. So that's why I am choosing uh, inches uh, for length. Now click OK. Uh, once see the sketch, uh, the given figure having uh, three circles, one center circle. Uh, diameter is 3.12 inches second circle diameter is 4.50 inches this construction circle diameter is 5.25 inches now construct this uh, three circles by using circle tool now you can double click on this circle tool to the center point draw three circles first circle second circle and th third circle now you can apply the constraints for this three circles now you can click escape button double click on constraint first give the constraint for this circle the diameter is 3.12 inches 3.12 inches enter next second circle this diameter is 4.50 inches double click 4.50 inches next third one third circle diameter is 5.25 inches 5.25 inches now you can see the figure the last one is construction circle now you can select first uh, you can left from the uh, constraint tool just you can click escape now choose uh, third circle and in, in sketch tools you can choose uh, construction or standard element for converting continuous line to construction line just you can you can click here now you can turn off uh, construction or standard element now uh, you can see here in top side having uh, uh, this entire sketch having uh, three circles these three circles are having uh, include angle is uh, 120 degrees so you can construct only this circle next you can rotate uh, uh, this circle with 120 degrees now you can construct circle two circles uh, at this vertical axis vertical line now choose circle the circle uh, inside circle radius is 0 0.75 inches outside circle diameter is 0 0.75 inches just you can uh, place the cursor here it shows one vertical axis at this construction line you can construct one uh, two circles this is the first circle next one second circle now you can click escape button now apply the constraints for these two circles first one is uh, diameter 0 0.75 double click 0 0.75 second circle second circle radius is 0 
seven pi. Now choose radius zero point seven pi. Enter. Uh, you can see here this uh, outside circle having one uh, curve with uh, this cent medial circle. Just uh, for drawing this cor uh, this arc, you can choose corner tool. In this, you can choose uh, no trim tool. Now you can choose uh, this outside circle and uh, this middle circle. The radius is 1.50 inches. Enter. Similarly, you can choose uh, middle circle and this uh, outside circle. The radius is 1.50 inches. Now you can uh, trim the unwanted lines by using quick trim tool choose quick trim uh, remove the unwanted lines this line this line this line this line this line this you can zoom the sketch and remove the unwanted lines by using quick tool trim <clears throat> now uh, you can rotate the, this uh, top side curves one is circle and this uh, second outside circle with uh, curves by using rotate tool rotate before going to choose rotate tool first you can select the elements uh, this curve choose this curve uh, this outside curve this curve also next circle next you can choose the rotate tool rotate to the center point uh, it shows uh, instances uh, uh, we want uh, two copies and including uh, duplicate mode with constraint conservation to the center point enter the angle value the given angle value is 120 degrees 120 enter next uh, next uh, remove the unwanted lines by using quick trim tool this line this line uh, this curve this curve also next you can apply the you can draw that to uh, three uh, now you can join the center uh, center lines from center point now you can choose the line tool draw the join this circle center point and uh, middle circle center point next uh, similarly circle center point and uh, center circle center point similarly uh, this circle you can zoom the sketch so choose the center circle center point and uh, center point of center circle now apply the constraints here uh, 120 degrees the one constraint choose constraint choose this one and uh, this one the 120 degrees similarly this edge Uh, this edge and uh, this vertical edge 120 degrees now you can apply the constraint for uh, uh, this white color elements uh, first you can apply the coincident point for this center circle now we can choose the center point of uh, this center uh, this small circle center and similarly uh, choose this construction circle here uh, now choose constraint defined in dialog box in this you can choose coincidence okay
now these two circles this uh, center circle and this curve also coincide with uh, uh, with respect to this construction line now apply the tangency for these two curves <coughs> now choose this curve and this curve uh, constant defined in dialog box in this you can choose tangency now click ok this curve also constrained next you can choose this curve and uh, beside curve choose uh, tangency ok <coughs> similarly apply the coincident point for this uh, small circle and construction circle choose center point of small circle and uh, this construction circle coincidence click ok now apply the tangency for these two curves choose uh, this curve and uh, this beside curve tangency ok choose this curve and beside curve and choose tangency ok <coughs> well, finally the given sketch is uh, drawn in the CATIA v5 software Now you can adjust the dimensions. Now you can also remove the uh, repeated dimensions. Hide or show. This dimension also repeated. Choose hide or show. This dimension also repeated. Hide or show. This dimension also repeated. Choose hide or show. Uh, this circle's dimension also repeated. Just you can hide the uh, bottom side uh, uh, dimensions. Just you can uh, hide the dimension only for uh, uh, neatness. Hide or show. Hide or show. Uh, this is the final sketch for the given 2D uh, car gasket uh, sketch. I hope this is very clear to everyone. Thank you for watching. Please do like and subscribe my channel for more updates.